hi Taurus uh, welcome to your September 2023 uh, general kind of overview uh, for this I'm going to use major arcana only and I'm going to pull three now these three cards are going to represent uh, card number one things as you see them card number three things as they really are and card number two the factor that is preventing you currently from seeing things as they really are like the inside information if you like so what i'm going to do is split the deck into three and pull three major arcana cards i will take reversals for this uh, this is just for like i say a big a sort of general overview of things so card number one the magician get busy 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 card number two the hierophant and card number three oh, how did that come up okay that's hermit in reverse so we got the two elderly dudes with the white beards on the table always nice to see the pair of them there right let's have a look at this okay really interesting because the hermit when he's in the upright is a very kind of inactive energy in terms of sort of physical action or going places or kind of visibly doing stuff all the action in the hermit is happening internally all he's got there is that stick to help him with gravity and that light to sort of guide him and that's the inner light of the mind and the heart and hopefully the mind and the heart like linked up and uh, speaking to each other well uh, so it's it's all kind of internal action here in the magician we've got visible action this is the kind of ta-da here i am look what i can do <laughs> for my next trick type thing okay so there are two types of action there's the action you can see and the action you can't see but this one is in the reverse so it's kind of another version of this one let's talk about the hierophant here in the middle right what i'm getting here taurus is a warning okay it's a warning what i'm getting here is that if you don't keep like a really really good check on your kind of moral compass that's the hierophant the moral compass in terms of where where it takes us in the world and where it takes us in our dealings with other people uh, the female counterpart of this the high priestess is more akin to the hermit this is more about the internal knowing the internal direction the internal compass the internal north star but here in the hierophant this is a very public setting he's a public figure okay and he's being watched and he's being listened to and he's handing down like the spiritual rules to the collective and I think this would be really useful the energy here of the hierophant to bear in mind this month when you're doing what you're doing when you're, you're kind of expressing yourself and manifesting action bringing stuff about creating karma here in the magician card it would be really worth bearing this stuff in mind and making sure may i say that on the moral front and the spiritual front but definitely on the moral front that your i's are dotted and your t's are crossed and that no matter sort of what forces may be acting upon you and seeking to push you this way and that that you maintain your own kind of inner moral stance um, if you take your eye off this 
and this really is a heads up, um, what's going to happen or what could happen is that all this inner knowing, all this, this work that the hermit undertakes to sit quietly alone in meditation, looking into that lantern, looking at that inner light, the light inside, could be for the birds it could all be for the birds and just kind of just kind of end up with what starts out here as i'm going to do this and i'm going to do that as basically just some sort of chaotic process of stuff just kind of tumbling around in a, in a disorganized and ineffective way so the message I've got here for you, Taurus, for September 2023 is keep checking back with yourself. Keep checking back with yourself and making sure that what you are enacting in the world, in your dealings with other people, is in accordance with your inner light and holding on to that. And don't let events or people blow you off course this month right that's it as I say make sure morally that your t's are crossed and your i's are dotted and that you are that you can account for yourself all right if your if your actions are called into question later make sure that your motivations stay good uh, because as I've said so many times, no matter what people do, no matter the ridiculous, frustrating, utterly mysterious and puzzling, what the fuck are they actually doing? Reactions that we have to other people's actions. All anybody is doing is trying to feel okay and trying to feel better. And that includes you, Taurus. So don't forget that. We, in that respect, we are all in it together. So make sure that you are absolutely solid in your motivations for what you are bringing into the world. And um, don't get blown off course by snap reactions. And uh, yeah, try to respond rather than react. And if you want to have a, a, a quick reaction, just take a little bit of time before you actually enact that and uh, you'll probably have uh, better results from that. Right then, Taurus, I'm going to leave that there. Thank you so much for watching. Um, do feel free to throw the YouTube algorithm a little bone <laughs> with a like or a comment or even a subscribe if you want to see more of this kind of content. All right. Thanks ever so much. Take care. Have a wonderful month. Bye bye.